the lives of some very sick children, but New Jersey parents say that they are forced to jump through hoops to get a prescription. This week of victory, a bill passed the state legislature making it easier to get medical marijuana for kids. But will it help? CBS 2's Jessica Schneider has more. Here you go. Let's wait. Little Vivian Wilson is two years old, but for her entire life, she's been suffering from Gervais syndrome, a severe form of epilepsy. It's been an absolute roller coaster. You know, we started off with a healthy second baby. Two months later, she had her first seizure. Now she has multiple seizures every day. Seizures so severe, she has to wear an eye patch and glasses to lessen the effect of triggers like bright lights and patterns. Her parents have tried dozens of treatments with little luck. Her seizures did not respond to conventional rescue medications, so we were always calling 911. So Megan and Brian Wilson started talking to parents of other Gervais syndrome kids, particularly in Colorado and California. They learned medical marijuana might be the answer, and while it is legal in New Jersey, getting the right kind for kids is difficult. The type of marijuana that these children need is not going to get them high. The problem? It isn't easy for parents to get their kids the strains of medical marijuana they they need at the only dispensary in the state right here in Montclair. The law is very strict about what can be administered and even requires three different doctors to sign off on the prescriptions for their kids. We had to make a bunch of phone calls and we pretty much had the door shut in our faces all over the place. Adults only need one prescriber and kids need strains of marijuana with less THC, the ingredient that gets people high, and more of something called CBD. Pediatrician Laura Popper says restrictions for kids should be East. If it works it, and it's controlled within a medical environment, I have no problem with it at all. The New Jersey legislature has just passed a bill that would allow kids to take marijuana in different forms, like pills or oils, and only one prescriber would be necessary. But Governor Christie still needs to sign the bill. I would love every child in New Jersey who's resistant to traditional medications to be able to get this. She would be able to start living a life again. A chance at a semi-normal life. <laughs> for a two-year-old who has barely had the chance to live. In Scotch Plains, New Jersey, Jessica Schneider, CBS 2 News.